Hey everyone, Tinman here, back with today's Daily Jail update, and a happy Thanksgiving to all of my American friends. And to all of my non-American friends, happy Thanksgiving to you too. You know what I am thankful for this Thanksgiving? That both Pudge and Ark Warden are in jail. Two of the most commonly played units that are just show up in every kind of composition are both in jail today. On the flip side, you know what I'm not thankful for? My favorite character, Legion Commander, is in jail today. So, unfortunate, won't be able to play all of my fun Legion Commander comps uh, today. Uh, just one unit banned completely kills those compositions. Fair enough. We've had it too good for too long. It's okay that she's in jail for one day. She'll be back tomorrow, uh, back at full strength. So anyway, we've got Pudge, Lifestealer, and Drow Ranger, three of the early game Heartless units, all jailed out. And that's a really big hit to any composition trying to get even up to four Heartless. You're going to need Lich to even complete four Heartless, which pretty much rules it out of the meta. I would not really be looking towards playing any kind of Heartless composition. You know, maybe if you splash Heartless in, say, a Knight's build with, say, Abaddon and Necrophos, that's fine. But otherwise, it's not really a good idea. We also see a couple of Hunters banned out, Draw Ranger and Wind Ranger, and I don't think Wind Ranger is that big of a deal. She's fairly easily replaceable by a lot of other Hunters, but Hunters typically were the ones that wanted to get those large amounts of, of armor shred from the Heartless bonus because they deal all physical damage. And of course, with two of them missing, and of course Draw Ranger missing, you probably don't want to go towards too many Hunter compositions. Perhaps in the late game, if you want to splash in, say, like Mirana, Medusa, plus Sniper. That's still a very valid core of a late game uh, damage output, but otherwise kind of early game Hunter compositions, even ones built around Beastmaster, are going to be a lot weaker because you're also missing Bristleback, who's a big contributor to the high physical damage and the brawny bonus, which also plays off Heartless bonuses. So this jail really conspires in a number of different ways to reduce the strength of those types of compositions. We also see a couple of Assassins banned out, actually three Assassins, with Faceless Void, the Ace of Assassins, as well as Nyx, Assassin, and Templar all out. You can still complete the six Assassin bonus because Ember Spirit was recently added to the Alliance, and it still keeps it a valid, um, a valid build, but I wouldn't be too keen on trying it missing so many pieces, so many powerful pieces, really. Templar and Faceless Void are two of the most individually powerful units. And then Nyx Assassin kind of bridges the gap into Insect Bonus, which was a very common pairing with Assassins. So where does that leave us? That's a lot of things that are not in play, but what is in play? Well, we don't see any mages really affected here. Of course, Primordials are doubly affected with, Pri with Faceless Void and Arc Warden. But Primordials were recently nerfed, and you probably didn't want to get up to six Primordials anyway nowadays in Mage compositions. And otherwise, all mages are pretty much available, so look for lots of mages to be played. And also, some of the recent alliances that got buffed, the Knights and Warlocks, are both very much available today. There's no, no downside on any of those builds, and I've been really liking Knights and Warlocks when, when they're available. And today's Jail really allows both builds either combined, you know, with four Knights, four Warlocks, or just four Warlocks plus a combination of other things like Warriors with uh, CC, or perhaps... Um, perhaps with knights, or perhaps just um, other damage dealers like druids or savages even. Uh, lots of good combinations for four warlocks, which was buffed in the patch just yesterday, and I think it's a very strong composition that is completely available today. So make sure you try that out. I think it will be a good idea. Um, other than that, you know, that those are kind of my big three compositions coming into today. And let me know if there's anything else that you find that's interesting because this jail definitely hits a couple strategies pretty hard but leaves most of it intact. Thank you so much for watching. Good luck in your games today and I will see you tomorrow.